Ah uh, yes, another new bike. I've been teasing you guys on Instagram, posting, uh, oh, seeing the back of it, uh, posting little, God it's bright out here, holy shit, posting random little uh, pictures of the bike, seeing what your guys' guesses are, um, and in each one of those pictures, I said that uh, the reveal video would drop today, so here it is. Um, before I show you guys the bike, it's it's a project. Uh, if you guys seen my rant video, um, I was talking about trading the Audi for a bike or selling it, buying a bike. Well, I ended up trading it for that guy. It's a '99 YZF R6 with 40,000 miles. It runs ish. Um, I know the carbs need to be clean. They need to be synced. It needs new plugs. Uh, it's got like a wicked bog uh, past half throttle, so. Um, all signs point to a tune-up issue, but needs new fairings, um, all that sort of stuff. So you guys are going to literally watch me put this bike together the way it should have been put together instead of being put together by somebody who shouldn't even fucking touch a bike because the more and more I tear into it, like I've already had all the fairings off of it just to kind of like inspect it and I just straighten the front end out because the previous owner laid it down. Um... The more and more I dig into it, the more and more I realize some people just shouldn't fucking be anywhere near a bike. But, I'll flip you guys around and take you guys through it. So here it is. The uh, fairings are literally destroyed. I don't know what the hell the guy did. But, this is... Oh yeah, seats are ripped. But the fairings are trashed. The thing's just disgustingly covered with grease uh, it's got a stock pipe grease everywhere it's got a hot bodies under tail which one of the lenses is missing um, what else uh, it's got power stands clip-ons uh, it's got different blinkers um, paint missing off of it here's here's the funny part there's a big chunk out right there and then if you guys look at this one what the hell was up with that like did somebody destroy this and just try and remake it it's like they use like super hardcore bondo but I mean all the fairings on this thing are just completely toasted you can see where it was laid down right here um, got some more rash right in here uh, luckily, this is the only part it got the cases is just right here. So that's kind of cool. Um, got these tags. I don't know if these are stock or aftermarket or what the hell. But I mean, it's kind of hard to see on camera just the condition of it. But paint's cracked. It's got one little dent in the tank right here. Um, seats ripped right here, too. Just somebody should nobody loved this thing is what happened. This thing just got beat on or something. I I don't know. But somebody definitely did not love it and maintain it very well. So I'm gonna fix it. Because no bike should be in this condition. So like I said, you guys are gonna watch me totally go through this bike, do it the way it should have been done the first time. You know, uh, we're going to go through putting new fairings on it, um, doing the carbs, plugs. Um, since I'm a broke ass and can't afford to get a new pipe, uh, I'm going to make my own shorty by chopping down the stocker. Uh, so I'll take you guys through that. Pretty much anything I do with this bike to fix it and make it back to being a nice bike, I'm going to bring you guys through, show you how to do everything. Um, have you guys go through it with me, you know, all that stuff. So, this is yet, again, another build series slash project. Kind of like how the YZ was, um, how the Silverado was. So, I don't know, man, like I said, some people just should not even fucking touch a bike. It's, I, f I feel bad for it. I really do. I feel bad for the bike because it wasn't maintained. It wasn't taken care of. It was just thrashed on and... You can't do that shit, man. You got to take care of your stuff. You got to do the maintenance. You got to put the time in. You know, you got to treat it right. 
because if you fuck up and don't do something correctly, it'll kill you. You know, if you do shit half-ass and it's important shit, you know, like, I'm going to make sure all the handlebars are tight, the front end's tight, because I don't want to go down the highway and have the fucking bars fly off, because I really don't want to die. So, like I said, you guys are going to watch me completely go through this bike, do it right, do it the way it should have been done the first time, instead of fucking haphazardly, and uh, make a nice bike out of it. I'm excited for it. Um, I was kind of wanting another project, so um, this will this will be a fun one. But, uh, like I said, I've been dropping little uh, hint pictures at you guys for the last few days on Instagram. So, here's the reveal video. Um, I'm going to start tearing into this thing today and uh, at least get it cleaned up and kind of get like a parts list going and uh, figure out what to start with first. So, as always, man, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys have a killer day. Uh, if you want to see me turn this bike back into a nice motorcycle instead of a thrashed on, beat up bike, hit that subscribe button and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Later.